And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. Stuart, how do you see this one going? Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Balak. Javier Zanetti. On the ball, Balak. Now Kaká. Antonio Di Natale. Mohamed Kudus. And the defenders know they need to get tighter. Well, still an issue here. And no problems at all for the keeper. Fernandez. Di Natale. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Laurent Blanc, Ramirez, Enzo Fernandez, and on to Ramirez. Viertz. Here's Ronaldo. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Florian Wirtz. Surely! Well, it might still work out for them. And Brom had enough about him to deal with the threat posed. Frankie de Jong. On the ball, Rafael Leao. And the degree of difficulty wasn't all that high in terms of the save. Ramirez. Well, this is far from over. We're going to have five minutes of stoppage time. Zambrotta. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. And well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Well, advantage Tottenham after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from being decided. And the keeper has it now. Zanetti. Kaká, Isaac, a fine use of the ball. Balak. Well, it's opened up, but into the keeper's gloves. Cristiano Ronaldo, perfectly positioned to take it away. Javier Zanetti, and teammates around him. Kaká. And the penalty has been given here. To make it 2-0. Will he finish? And slot it home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Ake. And the throw into Spurs. Lucio, Zanetti,
Now Kaká. Just 15 minutes remaining. And they have possession again. Promising move from Tottenham. And deflected beyond the byline, so a corner here. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Well, almost at full time, and it really has gone swimmingly for Spurs. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play, and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. And the referee blows his whistle, and Tottenham are the victors. They get the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area. It's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It is Tottenham Hotspur facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Kaká and he has options available well didn't go to plan in the end a Spurs free kick it's going to be well not enough subtlety about that free kick I'm afraid Kuehl Kulit Zambrotta and here's Saliba Rud Hulit. Hulit has it. Now with Cantona. And on to Kuehl. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Kaká. Enzo Fernandez. Here's Isaac. Zanetti. It needs an accurate cross. Surely! Well, there's an example of how to press high up. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Zambrotta. The ball with Luka Modric. Granit Xhaka. Cantona. Modric. Zanetti does the ball winning. Manchester City have it back now. Eric Cantona. Now with Zambrotta. And there it is! The opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. goal uh, back underway here. How will Spurs reply to that setback? Zanetti. The first half here comes to an end. So back in business here, City with the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. Promising move from Tottenham. This could square the game, and with that, they thwarted the opportunity. A magnificent stop. Well, it should be a goal, but take nothing away from the keeper. That's a brilliant save. And with that, 
the attack fizzles out. Must score! Well, an attempt to forget all about, unfortunately. Yeah, got it all wrong, trying to pass it into the corner, opened up his body, but didn't make the right sort of contact. Zambrotta. Now with Kuehl. Given away by City. And back to the keeper. Modric. And a free kick awarded by the referee. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. And stopping the danger. Antonio Di Natale. Is it going to be? And it nestles in the back of the net. A goal for Tottenham Hotspur, who now are on level terms. Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. Back on the way, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Jairzinho. It's with Joao Cancelo. And time is of the essence. Corner awarded to Manchester City. Sound piece of defending. Could be dangerous. And it comes down to the final five minutes. Ramirez. Isaac. On the ball, Kaká. It is still level, but Spurs on the attack. Can they break the parity? Ramirez! And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. And with that, the referee says that is the end of the match. And Spurs victorious. Their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both.